Hi guys, I'm Dave. I'm Shirley. This is Miss Madeline, our home away from home, and this is Down, Down the, the Road, Road We Go. Go. Hi guys, this is Dave and I'm with Down the Road We Go. This is our first video, so it might be a little strange. We got some echo in here because we're in the shop and we don't have a good microphone yet, but we're getting there. So let's start off with, we're having a problem. And every time we go camping or we stop for the night for whatever reason in Walmart or in a campground, we're only staying the night, we've got the bike rack on the back. And we've got the bikes and they're covered up and of course, right there is where the 50 amp plug is. Now, where the pain comes in is trying to get that 50 amp cable up underneath the bikes and stuck in there. You got to take the bag off for the bikes. It just doesn't work. It's a real pain. So I think we've come up with a solution. What we did was we're, we made a pigtail, or we had a make, we had a pigtail made for us, and this is what it looks like. It's about a four foot pigtail. You've got the female that's going to go into the back of the 50 amp and then on the bumper to the side over here we're going to mount this box that's got the male version so that our cable can plug into that and then go to the campground the generator whatever we got to hook it up to and we're going to attach it with that bracket I've made so hopefully this is going to work and save us from having to undo those bicycles or the bag just to get a little bit of power when I come back, we'll see how to put it on. Okay guys, so here we are. We're getting ready to hook this up. We should have turned the TV down. Let's go do that. Hi guys, we're back. We're going to go ahead and try and hook this up now. What we're going to start with doing is hooking it up to the trailer. Okay, the hard part is always getting that screwed in there real good. So we've got that real good. Okay, now what we're going to do is mount this, tuck this down in here. We'll strap all this down later. What we're going to do is we're going to end up mounting that right there. That way it's out of the way of the bikes. We don't have to hook it and unhook it. It's also ready to go. So we'll go ahead and drill some holes and we'll go ahead and mount this and we'll be back. Okay everyone, we've got it hooked up. We've got the 50 amp connector in the back of the trailer. We've got the uh, mount mounted on the black pipe. We've got the shore power hooked up to it to make sure everything works. We've turned it on, everything's correctly wired. It's all working, nothing's burning, which is a good thing. And in case you wonder what that black tube is, that's where we put our sewer pipe. Uh, so if you need some information about that and how to make it, just uh, you know, leave a message and we'll get back to you as soon as we can. Uh, the next step at the end of this video will be a, a screen grab to show you where to go get stuff. Now you can get it at eBay or you can get it at your local uh, RV dealer, either one. Uh, eBay is a little bit cheaper, but you know, if you don't want to wait, you can go ahead and just go to the RV dealer and get it. You also need a piece of 50 amp cable for the wire and have an electrician hook it up for you is the best thing to do. I hope you enjoyed the video and if you liked it, give us a thumbs up uh, and please subscribe to us. If you don't like it, well give us a thumb down, but you know, leave us a message and let us know what you didn't like about the video so we can improve them uh, when we make the next one. We hope to see you, uh, you know, if, you, if you subscribe to us, of course you'll be able to uh, Check up on us and find out where we're going or travels and some more tips. So we hope you have a good day and enjoy the video. And down the road we go.